Hello, Jacob. This is Liana. <clears throat> Sorry. And today I will be showing you to export and import products and update it. So as you can see on my screen, we are already on our inventory module and in the products tab. And the list of products are already on a list view. So let's say I just wanted, um, let's say let I just wanted, um, specific products that I wanted to update. So I will be doing the favorite ones. But if you wanted to update all, you could just click this one. But for this demo, I will be choosing five products from our from the favorites. So let's do the the drawer, the cabinet, the dining table, the dining chair, and the simple study table. So I have five here. Now let's click actions and click export here. Once we click that, let's click the I want to update data, the import compatible export. And then let's click import, export, sorry, export. Now, when we open the file, it will show us the um, the data that we um, that the data of the products that we want. So this one, right? Now. Let's say that I wanted to change the, the standard price and the list price. Check. So, um, Our favorites. Let me just double check the pricing. Do I erase this? Raise, remove, remove. Okay, so enable editing. Now the standard price, let's check for two West drawer is 225. Okay, so standard price is for cost, list price is for the sales price. Okay, I have to take note of that. Now I wanted to edit the cost, which is the standard price. So let's say I wanted to make this 150, 380, 450, 200, and 100. Now let's change the list price for this. Mm -hmm. Now I wanted the lease price for this to be 250 or let's say 275 for the cabinet door. I wanted it to become 500 for the pedestal dining. I want it to become 750 for the dining chair. I want it at 350 and for the simple study table, I want it to be at 200. You see how our prices jumps? That's because of inflation. Just kidding. Anyway, so I will click save. Saved and going back to our database. Now I will remove the favorites here and let's click the import records. Now let's upload a file. So this, this is the one open. 
and to test if the information on this product uh, on this file is compatible and doesn't have any errors we can click the test one here and it will show us that everything seems valid so let's import and it will give us a notification that five records successfully imported. Now, let's go back to the favorites. And let's check the list of the products that we changed. So let's go back to, let me show you this one. Okay. okay. So for the um two west two drawer nightstand so the standard price or our cost is at 150 we change it to 150 and the sales price is now changed to 275 next is the 36 inch so the sales price is now changed to 500 and the cost price is now changed to 380 and so on. So that's how we could update our products by using uh, by uh, the products information by using the import and export um, option or method. If you have further questions or if you have questions for this tutorial, please do not hesitate to email us or message Cigar um, so that we would be able to explain if you have further questions. Thank you so much, Jacob, and enjoy the rest of your day. Bye.